bunch of weather all to ourselves today. Unfortunately, it's still sticking around for some reason. Yeah, staying cold and the, because the temperatures have been below freezing, we just haven't really been able to yeah. melt. But guess what? We'll be seeing 70s by the end of the week. That's right. You heard that correctly. So from the teens this morning to 70s by the end of the week. Here's a live look from our storm track tower cam overlooking the Magic City this morning. Birmingham, you're at 26 right now. Same with Aniston. Clear sky in Tuscaloosa, 21 there. It's cold. It's whether it's 22, 26, or 16, we are seeing some frigid temperatures this morning. Jasper's at 16, 16 degrees in Moody, 19 in Fayette. Most people are going back to work and school today, but bundle up, especially if those kids have to hang out for the bus this morning. It is going to be downright frigid. Make sure all the skin is covered, long sleeves are necessary, scarves, coats, all the things of the like. Here's your storm track radar. Dry as can be outside, and that's the story. And dry is good. And as long as we see that sunshine, it will help to melt away what's left of the ice. Now, that sunshine took care of a good portion of it yesterday, but today I think it clears up the rest of it, and temperatures will climb well above freezing. Not necessarily this morning, as we're hanging out in the 20s at 6, 7, 8 o'clock, low 30s by 9, still below freezing there. But look what happens by 11 o'clock. 37, we're up above freezing at 12, 41 by 1 o'clock this afternoon. And I actually think high temperatures today will warm back into the mid to upper 40s. So that blue line of freezing air, that retreats later on this afternoon and evening. And then look what happens next. I'll be tracking a line of rain that slides in here. It could arrive as early as Wednesday morning or even Tuesday night with just a couple of showers late after sunset Tuesday. Those showers up in the Tennessee Valley around midnight Wednesday morning. I think the bulk of the wet weather still hangs to our north just a touch through Wednesday morning. But but then we could see just a few trace showers through central Alabama. So I am calling for rain on Wednesday, but that should all clear out by Wednesday night into Thursday. So only a small chance there on Thursday. But notice the rebound of temperatures. Temperatures back in the 70s for your Thursday and Friday. And then we'll see just those temperatures drop just a touch as we move into the weekend. So that's a look at your storm track seven day forecast. Now let's see how the roadways are doing right now.